Hey everybody, it's Jessica. Happy almost Christmas. Um, I am doing the Christmas tag from Lori. And Polycystic Sister. What's up, girl? Sorry it took me so long to do this. Um, I have been having a heck of a week. Um, if you notice me being very distracted, I am just waiting for my son to get off of the bus. So if you are watching this video, I am tagging you. Um, I am going to just tag anybody out there who is watching this right now. I will post the questions to the tag down in the bottom of uh, the description of this video. And if you do the tag, please come back and leave a comment on my video with a link to your video so then I can go and watch you do the tag. Okay? Okay. So... Question number one, colored lights or white lights? Um, on our Christmas tree, we have colored lights. Um, and outside, we have different colored lights, but not all different colors on one bush. I have solid white on one tree, solid white on another tree, solid red on certain round bushes, uh, solid green on other bushes. It really looks very, very full, and it looks very, very nice. I will try to insert a little bit of a video um, of our house at night right in here now. Go. Okay, number two, stockings or presents? Both. I love, usually in stockings, I give um, uh, like little crappy tchotchke kind of things. Like my husband gets... <laughs> shaving cream and razors and maybe like a video game. Um, and I get a little junky stuff in my stocking too. So that's fun. That's like where we put our gag gifts. But um, I love presents underneath the tree. Number three, give or receive gifts. Both. I love watching people open up presents that I get for them because I put a lot of thought into what I get for people. Um, especially now that I have my son and we do a lot of homemade gifts. I love to watch people open up the presents that he has made for them. Angel or star. Number four, we have an angel on the top of our Christmas tree. Um, number five, open presents quick or slow. We rip into them. We rip into presents. And it's so funny because now... I have a feeling that my son will want to get from one gift to another gift to another gift just to keep opening and opening and opening. But when he was smaller, he would open something up and be so excited. And, you know, he wants to play with that item that he just opened. He doesn't want to open another gift because he wants to, like, christen the new toy. He wants to play with the new thing. And it took forever to open up the presents. It took such a long time. Um, but it was very, very sweet to watch. I'm interested to see because he's almost five years old. So I'm interested to see how it goes this year. Number six, warm fire or sleigh rides. I have never, ever been, um, I mean, I've ridden a sled. I've never r rode a sleigh before, um, but I do like a warm fire. We don't have a fireplace, but I do, I do like a warm fire. So I will have to say warm fire. Um, Unless Santa wants to come this year and take me on his sleigh for a little bit. I'd be up for that, Santa. Number seven, snowball fight or making snowman. I love to build a snowman. I love making snowmen. In fact, I will insert some photos here of our previous snowmen. I love building snowmen. Okay, number eight, Christmas caroling or Christmas stories. I love reading to my son. I'm going to say Christmas stories. Um, I have never gone, quote unquote, Christmas caroling. But if I ever do, I want to do it right. I want to go and, you know, wear the whole thing in the big hat and the and the little, the hand muffler. Or a muffler, is that what it's called? I don't even know what it's called. But like a green velvet jacket and all that stuff. Um, number nine, red or green. Again, both. You can't have one without the other. Red and green. Like mistletoe. Number 10, were you naughty or nice this year? I was super nice. What kind of question is that, Lori? 
Always nice. Unless I'm watching The Walking Dead and then I curse like a drunken sailor. Um, can you name all of Santa's reindeer? Oh, no. Sorry. Number 11. Have you ever had a white Christmas? Yes, I have had a white Christmas. I live in New York, um, and it is possible to have a white Christmas. It hasn't been one recently. We've had snow flurries, but never waking up on Christmas morning and having a white Christmas. But I do remember a few Christmases waking up to, um, to snow. Number 12, can you name all of Santa's reindeers? I can, but I'll have to sing it. You know Dasher and Dancer and Prancer and Vixen, Comet and Cupid and Donner and Blitzen, but can you recall the most famous reindeer of all? You fill in the rest. Um, number 13, what is your Christmas wish this year? My husband and I are trying very, very hard to make my son um, a sibling. I would very much love to become pregnant <laughs> very soon. Um, but more than that, I wish that all of my friends and family have um, all their wishes and dreams come true this year and that we spend Christmas wrapped in love and with good food and with good family around. Some of your favorite Christmas songs. I love... Uh, I think probably my absolute favorite is Dominic the Donkey. Um, that is one of my absolute most favorite Christmas songs. And if you haven't heard it, you should try to find it. I'm sure that everybody's heard it. I don't know if it's just a New York thing. It might just be like a New York Italian kind of thing. But I do like Dominic the Donkey. Um, I love uh, White Christmas. And I like Blue Christmas, the Elvis version of Blue Christmas. I love that. Number 15, favorite Christmas film. Um, it's Elf. <laughs> I love Elf with Will Ferrell. I think he is hilarious. Smiling's my favorite. I absolutely love that movie. I could watch it any time of year. Number 16, is your Christmas tree real or fake? Our Christmas tree is fake. We've had a fake Christmas tree for many years. Um, and we like it that way. We have cats that eat and vomit pine needles all over the place. And I just, I don't want to get under the tree and have it fall on me like it did when we were using real Christmas trees. So we do the fake Christmas tree. Number 17, favorite Christmas food. I did mention that I'm Italian. Um, so Christmas Eve, for us used to be now that I'm married to my husband we haven't we haven't done this because we go to my sister-in-law's house on Christmas Eve but Christmas Eve in my house growing up was the night of seven fishes and we would have nothing but seafood we would have clams we would have bacala we would have um we would have uh, lobster tails crab legs shrimp it was just like a seafood frenzy and i absolutely love it but I think one of the things that I traditionally make now is an Italian, um, they call them honey balls, but really the right name for them is struffoli. And it is fried little balls of dough um, enrobed in honey and sprinkled with rainbow colored nonpareils. And they're really good. My husband says they're an acquired taste, but I have definitely acquired a taste for them. So that is it for the Christmas tag. Again, if you feel like doing this tag, do it. And leave me a comment below with the link to your video so I can go over and watch it. So until I see you guys next time, Merry Christmas. Bye.